Hey guys, it's Joanna here. Something I've always emphasized over and over again is a short workout is better than no workout. So if you only have 15 minutes in the morning, you can still get your workout done. I want you to start marching on the spot to get your body warmed up. I've designed this workout to be low impact, so you can get this workout done in your pajamas. There are seven exercises, okay? Each workout will be for 45 seconds long with 15 seconds rest in between. And the goal is to complete two sets. Kickstart your metabolism first thing in the morning and you will be burning a lot more calories throughout the day. And I can assure you, you will have a more productive and stronger day ahead. So let's do this. So I'm going to set my timer. I want you to give me your very best shot, okay? We want to work the entire body from the lower body to your upper body and to your abs, all right? So we have 50 more seconds and we want to get straight into the workout. The first workout is going to be kneel to squat pulses. So start lower down. I want you to lean back slightly and get up and get into squat pulses, okay? Four times and get back down, ready? And let's go. Lean back, tighten your core, come back up and pulse. One, two, three, four. Nice. Kneel back down, lean back, really lean back, tighten those core. Back up. One, two, three, four. Nice. Back down, lean, work those abs, wake those muscles up. One, two, three, four. This is also a really good way to really wake the entire body up. Up, stay low. One, two, three three, four, do not come high up, okay? Again, lean back, tighten those core, up. One, two, three, four, keep low, one last time. Come on, keep your body strong, keep your core tight, back up, really feel those leg muscles, push your butt back, and rest. Second workout, alternate lunge, touch down, okay? So start forward, take one step back, touch down, back up, and touch down, all right? Three more seconds, let's go. Down, look straight ahead, down. So I want you to bend your knees, keep them 90 degrees, and lunge down, okay? Your knee should almost touch the floor, but without touching the floor, come back up. Nice, touch, keep your body upright, chest open, and touch. Good, keep going, lunge, push your butt back. Feel your legs working, feel your butt working, feel your hamstrings working. And remember to pace your breathing. Nice. Chest up, do not lean forward. Chest up and just tap down gently. 10 more seconds. Last two. Keep going. Last one. Woo! Breathe out and rest. Next workout, hops and push up. So we want to work on our upper body now. So get onto the mat, start in a push up position, all right? I want you to hop in, out, one push up. Okay, ready, let's go. In, out, push up, nice. If you can't do it on your toes, get onto your knees, push up, hop in, out, knees, push up. Very good, hop in, out, challenge yourself, get onto your toes, nice. When you hop in, engage your core and work those abs as well. Good, keep your body straight, do not Arch your back and just keep your body straight and look gently down, nice. Give it a good deep hop, good, few more. Keep those upper body strong, come on guys. I know you are feeling your muscles burning. One last push up and woo, rest it out. My heart rate is pumping, I'm feeling tired but I know I'm going to start my morning really strong. Next workout cross plank jacks, okay? So again, start in a push-up position. Two jacks, okay? Cross over, two jacks, good. Cross, and two jacks. Again, this workout is working on your upper body and also your abs. Cross, keep your body straight. Do not push your butt too high up, okay? Halfway there, two jacks, cross, cross, Feel your obliques working. Two jacks, cross, cross. Woo! Remember to breathe. Do not hold your breath. Keep breathing. Cross, cross, and one last one. Cross, cross, two more, and 
rest it out. Oh. So you should feel your legs working, your upper body working. And we're not done yet, we're halfway there. I want you to get into dwarfin planks right now, okay? So, start in a plank position, stay low, okay? What I want you to do is go over your fingertip, push up into sort of like a downward dog. Forward and push your butt up. You should really feel your arms working, your shoulders, your triceps. So these are really slow movements, but it's going to really work on your upper body muscles. Up, push your butt up, feel your core engaged, over your fingertips, push up, nice. Over, keep going, up, keep those plank strong, okay? Up, last one more, and rest it out. Stay with me guys, two more workouts and you will get a one minute break, okay? Groin is next. So same thing into a plank position. You can choose the simpler version, which is to step forward, look up, back, step forward, look up and back, okay? So that's an easier version. Really feel your lower back stretched out. If you want to challenge yourself, then let's get into plyo groin is. Hop it out. Good, hop, woo, pace your breathing. Oh, I can see my sweat dripping on the mat, but I know that it is my fat crying. Keep going, guys. Feel those butt muscles working. Feel those leg muscles working. Feel your lower back engaged and your abs. Okay, give me two more. Last one. And rest it out. Oh, one final workout, okay? Half V touch to knee tucks. So, I want you to sit back onto your mat. I'm gonna wipe my sweat. Support your upper body with your hands, okay? Give me a solid knee tucks. Extend, half V tucks, and knee tucks, okay? Extend straight, and in, and up. Good. Small movements, but you will really feel your abs working. Up, in, and up. Good. Keep going, guys. Feel more. Up, knee in. I can feel my lower and my upper abs burning. Woo! Come on, keep going. Do not stop now. 15 more seconds, let's go. Up, in, up. Oh my God, in, up. Woo! In, and up. 10 more seconds. If you need to bend your knees slightly, okay? Up, in, and rest it out. Oh! Very, very, very well done. So now you have a one minute break. Grab yourself some water, keep yourself hydrated, wipe your sweat, and we want to do the entire workout once more for the second set, okay? So stand up, shake your legs a little bit, keep yourself hydrated, and wipe your sweat. Good job, second set soon. All right, guys you have about 20 seconds left, okay? So we want to get into the second set. You know all the workouts right now. I want you to give it your best shot, add as many reps as you can within the given time, but do not sacrifice proper form, okay? To so really work on targeting the right proper muscles, all right? So let's get back down onto the mat. The first workout is going to be a kneel to squat pulses. So three seconds left, and remember, we want to lean back. Let's go, lean back, up, and one, two, three, four small pulses down. Lean back, tighten those abs, pull yourself back up. One, two, three, four, good. Back down, remember suck those abs in as far as you can, and up, nice. Small pulses, but really effective work on your hamstrings, your quads, and also your glutes. Up, one, two, three, four. Okay, remember to push your butt back, all right? Back, push your butt back, do not hunch forward, do not collapse. One, two, three, four, very good. Last one, lean all the way back, up. Really feel those quads. One, two, three, four, good. Rest it out. Second workout, get back up. Alternate lunge, touch down, okay? So start in the center, and we want to lunge back and touch down, okay? So the opposite side. Three more seconds, let's do this, let's go. 
Touch down, look straight ahead, touch down. Nice. Look straight, touch. Knee almost touching the floor and push up with your heels. Back up. Good. Very good, guys. Keep going. Alternate sides. Nice. Lunge all the way down. Legs 90 degrees. Bring your knee almost touching the floor. Feel your legs burning. Feel your muscles burning. Those pain are good pain, okay? Keep going. 15 seconds left. Nice. Do not stop now. Keep your breathing going. Pace your breathing. In through your nose. Out through your mouth. Last one more. And the other side. Rest it out. Next workout, we want to focus on our upper body and also our core. So hops and push up. Breathe in, breathe out. Let's get onto a plank. Hops in, out, push up. Good. In, out, push up. Again, beginners, if this is difficult, get onto your knees and slowly progress from there. Knees, push, look straight ahead. In and out, okay? Very good. All right. If you can, challenge yourself and slowly get onto your toes. Small hops, but really crunch your abs in and feel your abs working. Good. Keep going. Woo! I can feel my upper body burning, my chest muscles working. Last one. And one more push up. Oh, rest it out. Fourth workout, cross plank jack, okay? So again, it's all about working the obliques, upper body, and also just the entire mid section. Three seconds, let's go. Woo! Two plank jacks, cross over. Nice, two. Keep your upper body strong, steady. Keep your back flat and cross. Good. Now keep going, cross. Good. Breathe in, gaze down gently, and just feel your abs and your arms burning at the same time. Woo! I can see my sweat dripping. It is all good. You're gonna feel so amazing right after this. Let's do it. Last one, cross, cross. And rest it out. Oh my God. Three more exercises, okay? Dwarfing plank will really focus on the triceps and the shoulder muscles, okay? Slow movements, but really focus on the upper body. Let's do it. Get into a plank, go over your fingertip, push up into a high downward dog, over, down low, up into a V, opposite V, up, and push. I am sliding because of my sweat. Keep going, guys. Stand tall on your toes, push up. Feel your arms as you go over your fingertips. Nice. Breathe. Almost there, three more seconds. Last one, and oh, rest it out. Groin is okay. So this is one of my favorite workouts, but it is one of the toughest. So you have an option to either do a beginner workout or the harder version, okay? So let's go, start and hop. Good, hop, look up, hop. Oh my God, feel your legs, your butt, and your upper body supporting you. Good, pace your breathing. Keep going. Again, beginners, if this is tough, you can always take a step back, back, forward, back, forward, okay? Follow your pace and eventually challenge yourself and push. Good, a few more. Woo! 10 more seconds. Second last workout. Do not stop now. If you can see your sweat dripping on the floor, remember to keep pushing yourself. Oh, one final workout. Half V tux to knee tux. Oh, I am absolutely naked. Oh, 
Who says a 50 minutes workout is simple? It is not, okay? Right, let's go. Knee tucks and a V tucks, okay? Good. If you need to bend your knees, you can bend your knees slightly, okay? Up, in, up. Keep going, guys. Knee tucks in. Feel your upper abs and your lower abs working. <sighs> Last workout. Keep going, 10 more seconds. Oh. This is not easy, but you got this, all right? Five more seconds. Last one. And oh. rest it out. Oh. That was two sets in 15 minutes. Well done, guys. Very well done. Now you can start your morning full of energy and sweat. <laughs> guys, I am absolutely sweaty. It wasn't an easy workout, but I'm feeling really good. So your challenge for the next six weeks is to stay active on a daily basis, no matter how short it is. If you stay consistent, if you build a consistent routine, I can assure you, you will start to lose weight and also tone up. So if you enjoyed this workout, be sure to like this video, Challenge your friend to start their morning with this workout. Share this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more fitness videos, healthy and really easy recipes, and also nutritional tips. All the best.